Okay, this app is called Little Bear Seas Tap and See Zoo. And this was um, created for children that have CVI, so uh, cortical visual impairment. And um, it has a lot of options, but you can see what's included in the app right here. But if we go back out and we click on settings, you'll see that we have options within background to change the color between black, white, red, yellow, purple, green, pink, and blue. Uh, we can put random color on or off. We're going to leave it on for now so I can show you the app. Select sound on pressing the uh, image. Whistle laughing one, applause or laughing two. We're going to leave that as random sound. Animals, lots of different animals to choose from. Bear, elephant, alligator, giraffe, or monkey. We're going to leave that on random. And then select color you can uh, the color of the animal so you can have black white red yellow green pink or blue what we're going to do is we're going to leave that on random too and select size and select speed i'm going to show you how that works so let's go back out and let's start the app so what you get is an animal bouncing around the screen and the idea is to follow the picture and touch the animal now, if you can't, if you touch up here or over here, you'll see that the animal moves towards your finger, which is very cool. So let's say I get to touch him. You get a random sound and you move on to the next screen. So remember, we've got the background and the animal color on random. So we've got a pink background, the animal stayed yellow. And we'll touch him again. And we'll move on. So you'll see that the background has changed to black. The bear is now pink and it's a different animal it's not an elephant it's a bear so you can see the kind of speed that this is moving around the screen and we'll touch him again but if we go back into settings and we select the size of the animal to the smallest and the slowest speed save that and let's go back out and play you'll see it moves a lot smaller and the an uh, a lot slower and the animal is a lot smaller so it helps those that may have more of an issue uh, following these sort of things around the screen. And again, it still follows wherever you end up touching until it reaches that point and the sounds change and the background changes every time you get it correct. So let's go and take a look at the largest size and the highest speed uh, just to show you how this works. We'll save that and let's go ahead and play. So you can see the animal is larger and the speed that it moves around the screen is a lot faster. So again, it will move towards your finger. Once you get it right, it will change. And you can, you can work with this on one color, one animal, one uh, size, one speed. Totally customizable to what it is you need to work with. But it really is a great app for children with CVI, um, so I highly recommend it. Check it out. Uh, lots of different, um, lots of different options, and uh, it seems to really work. And Crystal, thanks for recommending this, and uh, I hope this is what you um, wanted to see and can help children that have visual uh, impairment uh, to find an app that could work for them. Thanks.